Okay, so yesterday we already learned about uh, how to solve question involving standard form for addition and subtraction. Okay, and do you still remember when you do um, when you solve the question involving addition and subtraction? First thing you need to consider the the power. Okay, and then you want to increase the power or you decrease the power. Okay, so when you uh, move, when you increase the power, means that apa bila awak besarkan nombor, the single point kena gerak ke mana? Besarkan nombor? Ke kanan. Kalau besarkan nombor, kuasa kena positif ke negatif? Kuasa kena negatif. Dia kena mesti terbalik, besar, besar, kuasa negatif. Kecilkan nombor? Okay, gerak ke kiri kuasa kena positif okay, Ataupun kuasa kena tambah lah So now For multiplication and division You don't need to um, Increase or decrease the power Okay because Why? Okay why? Before I give you the answer I ask why you don't You don't need to increase or decrease the power Sama ada dan dek boleh potong refer to the first uh, chapter a to the power of m multiply by a to the power of n what happen a to the power of m plus n so you use this law for multiplication and okay for division of course a to the power of m divided by a to the power of n you need to sub subtract okay So you use this two law, okay? So let's say we have this two example. Okay, now you see the first example. First, you combine the number, okay? So let's say you solve the number first. Means that two multiply by three point six. So what we can do here? Put in bracket two multiply by three point six. Close bracket multiply by. 10 or to the power of 4 multiply by 10 to the power of 3. Okay, means that you need to rearrange. Susun dulu. Okay, the index you put at the back. Okay, kuasa tu letak kat belakang. Sebenarnya bracket ni tak wajib tapi kita tahu yang tu kita kena selesaikan. Okay, now 2 multiply by 3.6. Okay, 7.2 multiply by 10. 4 plus 3. Okay, right now I do step by step. After this, boleh skip lah step ni. So now 7.2 multiply by 10 to the power of 7. Is this your last answer? Yes. Okay, yes. Because this is already in standard standard form. Because the the value is less than 10. Okay, less than 10. Okay, second example. Same thing. So right now, six point five multiply by three multiply by ten to the power of negative four multiply by ten to the power of negative seven. Okay now, six point five multiply by three. What is the value? Nineteen point five. Okay, multiply by 10 to the power of negative 4 plus bracket negative 7. Okay, now 19.5 multiply by 10 to the power of negative 11. Is this your last answer? No, because we have 19. Still not in standard form. So what should you do? Decimal point move to the left or to the right? So de if decimal point move to the left, power increase or decrease? Nombor besar kita nak kecikkan. Kuasa kena? Besarkan lah. Tambah satu. So what is the answer? 1.95 multiply by 
Tan to the power of negative Tan Kuasa kena tambah satu kan Okay so negative tan Understand? 